Hey, what is up guys? It's your boy Michelangelo here bringing you another video. So, I woke up to a ton of DMs from you guys talking about we got us a new trailer for Kimetsu no Yaiba Demon Slayer Season 3, The Swordsmith Village Arc, and your boy is here. I really appreciate all the information, guys. Uh, you guys told me we have a new trailer plus a new key visual. However, regarding the new key visual, some of you told me that it has some major spoilers, so I'm only going to be checking out the new trailer. I don't want to check out the new key visual in case, you know, like you said, there's major spoilers. So I don't want to be spoiled on anything major, uh, you know, before we check check out um you know season three in april and everything like that so we're only going to check out the new trailer here break it down and see what we have here also before we get into it i just wanted to take this uh small opportunity to just thank you guys so much for all the support we recently hit 90,000 subscribers and it's all thanks to the support you guys have give, you know been giving me uh you know over the years and uh we're approaching one of the greatest milestones ever in my life um which is 100,000 subscribers so i just wanted to take this opportunity to say in case you're new to the channel my name is michelangelo please consider subscribing um, I cover anime, movies, video games, and lots more stuff here on the channel. So if you like, you know, to, you know, just hang out, you know, if you like good vibes and uh, just checking out anime, video games, and movie trailers, feel free to subscribe. I'd really appreciate the extra support. And uh, yeah, man, I, I'm I'm just so grateful for you guys. You guys are a blessing in my life, man. I'm 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 still in shock, man. We're getting so close. We're literally in the Infinity War. We haven't reached the end game. I think 99,000 will be the end game. Infinity War section right now <laughs> on the channel. But anyway, uh, and I'm super excited to jump into this, guys. So without any further ado, I've spoken enough. Let's jump right in. Three, two, one, go. Damn! Muichiro got his blade broken! Genya, okay? Mitsuri? Bro, Muichiro got his blade broken already? Damn, whoa! Awaken Nezuko! Bro, so much is happening! What? Haga Nezuka? Upper moves, okay? Bro! Yo! Bro! What? April 9th? Or is it April 15th? Bro, oh my, bro, bro, time out, time out! What? What? So much was thrown at me at once, bro. Like, give me a second to breathe, Kimetsu no Yaiba. God damn you, Photobol. Did you see that shot of Tanjiro's Hino Kami Kagura Retsujits? God damn, that's not the move, though, but... <laughs> Yo! And Muichiro got his blade broken already? God damn, wait, before we break this down, we gotta watch it again. Are you kidding me? What? Also, let me know down below in the comment section. Is it April 9th or 15th? This voice sounds so familiar, bro. What? Bro. We got our boy Tanjiro doing his Zen Shuju. Nezuko there. Bro. He got his blade broken. We got Genya there, okay? Mitsuri. Bro! Bro, look at this! I swear, man! Oh my... This right here, bro! 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 Oh my god! Nah. Oh my god, bro. That you... In Ufotable, which you already know stands for unlimited budget, is being used absolutely perfectly this time around. We'd love to see it. Bro, we gotta break this down. I'ma put it in super slow-mo. We're breaking down everything frame by frame, bro. What? So, hold up, hold up. Let me mute it one second, guys. So, the person speaking at the beginning, his voice sounds so familiar to me. It sounds like Kakashi's voice actor. And I remember you guys let me know in the comment section, back when he was uh, shown... 
uh, back when Tanjiro was fighting Daki and she saw, you know, Muzan's memories through Muzan's cells uh, when he appeared, you let me know that, you know, that swordsman's voice actor is Kakashi's, right? We still don't even know what his name is. But, bro, look at this blade. Is it his? I love the the golden, you know, like, grip and, and the cross guard, too. Mike, it reminds me so much, of, for any One Piece fans, it reminds me so much of... um of Zoro's uh, Yubashiri, the one he lost at Eni's lobby that got uh, rusted um, by that one, you know, Marine with the devil fruit rust, rust power. I totally forgot his name. But man, it kind of reminds me of that, like the cross guard of it. Man, that is so cool. So is it his blade? Feel free to let me know down below in the comment section if I'm right about that. Um, then we move on to Tanjiro here doing his Zen Shuju. Total concentration, love to see it. Nezuko here looks like... You know, she got her hair braided exactly the way Mitsuri has hers braided. I guess they're going to be friends, I suppose. She looks so cute, man. Love to see it. Yo, Tanjiro looks surprised by something here. That this is, bro, this is the shot right here, man. Did you see that? Muichiro got his blade broken already. And Okay, first of all, it kind of looks like he's fighting during the day. And he's fighting, I guess, a slayer? Because he's, he's blocking swords, uh, sword strikes, right? With that same expressionless look on his face, you know? Anime characters with no expression are always badass. So, as much as he may have gotten his sword broken here, I, I'm still hyped to see him fight, I guess, you know? But damn, I wonder who he's fighting. You know, whoever he's fighting must be stronger than him to be able to break his sword like that? What? Damn, and I love the color. Hold up. Of his Nichirin blade? Hold up. Let me see if I can get it. Oh, that was a nice shot right there. Here, uh, one second. There we go. It's got like a like a blue tint to it, a lighter blue tint, uh, kind of similar to Giyu's sword, but his is like more vibrant. You know, I'm trying to use big words to sound smart. His is more vibrant. <laughs> anyway, yo, that is crazy. So he's definitely fighting somebody. It's not a demon. Definitely can't be a demon because it looks like it's during the day. So he's fighting either a slayer or, you know, it has to be a slayer or another swordsman, right? Because, damn, he got his sword broken. Then we have Genya here, finally. He has his Nichirin blade after bitching about it during final selection. <laughs> but I'm excited to see him fight finally, man. We got to see him also in Mugen Train, I believe, uh, when all the Hashiras and Kagaya were getting the news regarding Rengoku's death. I recall seeing him with Giyome, training with Giyome. So my guess is um, probably his breathing style could be stone breathing, given that he was training with Giyome. That's just a wild guess there. But he looks fantastic, man. Uh, but his blade does seem... A little smaller compared to all the other slayers that we've seen so far, like Tanjiro, you know, Zenitsu, Inosuke, you know, Mitsuri, Muichiro. He seems like a little smaller, like a dagger, sort of dagger-ish, I guess, you know? But cannot wait to see him fight. Cannot wait to see him fight, man. Then we got Mitsuri here. Oh my god, I love the bendy... Bl oh, bro. Cannot wait to see what love breathing looks like. Actually, on a, on a side note, like, I, I learned how to say the, um, you know, the, the, their pillar names in Japanese. Like, for uh, Mitsuri, it's a uh, Koi Bashira, I believe, and for Muichiro, it's Kasumi Bashira, right? So, of course, which translates to their breathing techniques, which is Kasumi no Kokyu, right? And Koi uh, Kokyu, right? If I'm not mistaken, correct me for any Japanese fans of mine in the comment section. Let me know if I'm right about that. I'm excited to see their breathing techniques. I can only imagine what love breathing looks like, you know? And one thing I will say, um, I love Tengen, he's my second favorite Hashira, but I was rather disappointed with how many breathing techniques he had. You know, only three, we got to only see three, like the first form, Roar, fourth form, Constant Resounding Slashes, you know, fifth form, Megan, So-So, you know, String Performance, and uh, would we count his, you know, musical score technique as one? I, I don't think so, I really don't think so, but let me know in the comment section. So I'm hoping with Mitsuri and Muichiro, they have a wider variety of breathing techniques. Just like Rengoku did, man, he went in on Akaza with so many different flame breathing techniques. Hono no Kokyu, you love to see it. So I'm hoping with them they have more variety there. But she looks fantastic, love to see it, man. Yo, absolutely amazing. Then we have this shot right here, and I, I've, I never even mentioned this in my previous reactions, but Tanjiro is actually fighting without his Haori. I mean, the only time we've seen him do that when he, is when he was fighting um, Yahaba, right? Yahaba, if I'm not mistaken, his Haori came off, right? So, Haori less Tanjiro, love to see it again, man. And it looks like he's fighting. I love that they're not showing which demon it is, because I, I, I still don't know which demon we're going to be taking on in this season. But it seems that this demon has like a metal rod, uh, you know, or something going right to Tanjiro's eye which is crazy, but he dodges it, love to see it. We got Awaken Nezuko back, love to see that. Mu Muichiro again there, Mitsuri. We have some new characters. I don't think this is Haga Nezuka. This has to be a different character. So two new characters. We have the same masks, uh, masks as Haga Nezuka. 
you know? And then we have our boy Haganezuka there. Then we have all the Upper Moon Demons. I already reacted to that trailer. Very excited to see what Kokushibo's face looks like. Still haven't seen uh, him. I, you know, try my best to avoid anything to do with the Upper Moon meeting because a lot of you have been telling me leaks have been going out there. I'm trying my best to avoid Twitter, YouTube homepage, everything. I haven't seen anything so far. I want to react to it the day it comes out here in April so I can, you know, share that experience with you guys of, you know, the Upper Moon meeting and seeing what he looks like for the first time. Then we have here Nezuko grabbing our brother. Oh, this is the shot. Oh! I, I, I didn't even realize in my second and first watch through of this. His mark is changed again to how it was when he, you know, was fighting Yutaro when he cut off his head. Now, I'm very excited as well to find out more information regarding this mark. Like, is it a transformation like Super Saiyan? Like, can he go in and out of it, you know? Or is it like something permanent? Like, I'm very excited to, to learn more about that, you know? And it looks even more similar to how the, the Mysterious Swordsman, you know, that we saw during, uh, you know, uh, Daki's flashback, you know, of, uh, you know, Muzan Cells. Like, it looks similar to that Swordsman now even more than it did, you know, prior you know so I'm, I'm excited i'm excited to see that but bro look at he literally cracked the ground with that hinokami kagura bro that's never i've never seen a hinokami kagura technique like this before from tanjiro bro he's channeling his inner rengoku bro look at the stance look at the stance oh no no kokyu oh kuno kata rengoku esoteric art bro we love to see it tanjiro kokoro moyase let's go bro oh look at the animation bro the unlimited budget that's what that u stands for in ufotable you already know the vibes i will be here I will be here in April, man. Let me know. April 9th or 15th. Let's, let's just feel free to let me know, man. Oh, yo. This was a fire trailer, guys. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. I cannot wait, bro. Ah, day one, we're there. Day one, we're absolutely there. Let's, let's talk about this down below in the comment section. Are you hyped like I am? Yeah, like there's no way you cannot be, bro. Ah. I'm excited. I'm so excited. But anyway, that's it from me, guys. If you enjoyed my reaction to this and my breakdown as well of everything, please do me a favor and subscribe to the channel if you're new. It really does help out a lot. Also, give the video a thumbs up for the hype of Kimetsu no Yaiba Season 3 of the Swordsmith Village arc. I'd really appreciate that. Also, make sure to um, hit the notification. Did I say hit the notification? But I'm so jumbled up, bro. I'm so hyped. Hit the notification bell if I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then make sure to follow me on all my social media, Twitter and Instagram. Links to that will be down below in the description of this particular video. You can also feel free to join our Discord. I'm already out of breath bro discord channel member patreon all that please 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 feel free I'm, i can't even speak bro like i'm so hyped all of that info will be down below in the comments i really in the comments in the description bro i'm done i'm done i'm I, i'm just gonna go watch this trailer a million more times i'm sure you're gonna do the same <laughs> anyway guys please do it here take care of each other peace out have a lovely day or night where you may be and i'll see you guys next time god damn bro i'm so hyped yo